Hey everybody, this is the Wax Man. I've uh, decided to come to you, as always, uh, from my dining room area with the backdrop. I've made a couple adjustments to this next video. I'm hoping that it'll work well. Uh, the last video I had talked about how they're packaged differently from Fairfield. And so I just wanted to show you the boxes that I currently still have of, that I, that I want to open. Um, we did the Reggie Jackson one in the last video. So this is our next box. And then we've got these two boxes. I, I'm probably going to just do these in these order. Uh, this is a nice Wade Boggs right here. And, of course, we all know about this man. He likes to hit other players when they're trying to tag him out. So, Alex Rodriguez, shout out to you, buddy, for playing fair in sports and games. So that said... Let's go ahead, I'm going to move these back a little bit, and then we're going to go ahead and let's open this up. I love these tabs on the bottom to make life simpler, more easy. And let's see, oh, look at that, they all slid out. Nothing in the top rattling around, so there's no special stuff there. And there we go. All right, so let's see what we've got here. We're going to go ahead and separate these cards. Now, this box also has the 1990 upper decks. And now that last box, the upper deck cards were not stuck together. There was a uh, hologram that was stuck to one of the cards, which was interesting. So let's go ahead and let's take a look at these cards here. Let's make a little bit of space. All right, let's see what we got here. Pujols. Now, Allen and Ginter, um, I know that when I first looked at these way back, what, about eight, six, six years ago or so, I wasn't too sure. Uh, I'm not a fan of some of the cards that they carry, but longevity-wise, I think that these cards uh, in the long run just seem to be pretty nice cards. Let's see what we've got here. As always, these cards are flipped around. Here's a nice Jim Tomei. Looking down at the catcher saying, uh-huh, yeah, buddy, I got something for you. He probably thinking about hitting him upside the head with that bat. Let's see, let's flip some of these cards around. Ah, here we go. Mike Stanton, Giancarlo, that's a nice card there. The uh, 2016 set, Francisco Rodriguez. This is always nice when you when you have a team card and you can have many of the players. I've always been a fan of those uh, because I, I always say, okay, this is kind of a special card. Um, if they would kind of short print them instead, I think people would really, really go after these even more. Well, here's a nice Future Stars of Lance McCullers. Here's a DJ. Now, maybe he's in the wrong business if his name is DJ. He should probably be doing music instead, right? Daryl Boston, let's see here. Harry Spillman, Floyd Bannister, oh, 1987 Kirby Puckett. Highlights on the 1988 score. Let's see, Terry Mulholland. John Smiley. Cito Gaston. Tom Lasorda. There we go. Let's see. Oh, that's a nice little run in a row. Marty Clary, Jerry Royce, Oil Cam Boyd. I actually met Oil Cam Boyd. Uh, man, that was back in the, it had to be 90, 91. Uh, helped him uh, get some furniture. We delivered it to his, his location when he was in spring training. There's another Marty Clary, Corey Snyder. So here we go. That's a nice little card. Not too bad, slightly off centered. No major league record there, but he did play. It's always kind of nice when the players can, uh, you know, get some years in. You know, sometimes players peak, bef you know, before they finish college, before they finish high school, within a couple of years. And that's why when you have a player that, that stays so long in the league, and we're not talking about Corey Snyder, but, we're, you know, people like Jim Cat. that's a K-A-A-T. He played for so many years. Vita Blue. Willie McCovey, they played for, like basically between the three of them, they probably averaged 20 years, right around there. 
That tells you the quality of the player and the ability to play, not lack of players, but the ability to play and still take care of their team. Here's Fred McGriff, Tony Pena, Steve Sachs, Joe Carter, Mike Shosha, Darren Holmes. These are always kind of nice cards. I don't know. I, I'm torn between them, whether I like them or not, but they're kind of nice. This is the was it, Series 1, uh, 92. Mike Felder. Okay, let's see here. Let's move these out of the way. Jerry Brown. Dan Pasqua. Ernest Riles. Randy Bush. Rich Gedman. Vince Coleman. Now, whenever Vince is on a card and it's got red highlights in the background like it does in this one, it makes the cards look really nice. But then there's other players with colors that they don't match and it doesn't look good. Gene Nelson, Mark Higgins, Bob Ojeda, Dennis Rasmussen, Louis Aguayo, Ernest Riles. Let's see here. See, there we go. There's the other Mike Stanton, <laughs> the original. Uh, Dwight Evans. I know somebody's going to get on me about that one with Gio. You know, you know. <laughs> Reggie Harris. Jeffrey Leonard, Kevin McReynolds, Diamond King. Oh, here's a nice Ricky Henderson. Two dots there, but that's a nice little card there. It's a nice addition if somebody does not have it or they need to replace it. The back is slightly crooked. The front, yeah, the front's in pretty good shape. Here's a Mike, Mike Boddicker, Sport Flicks. They were just too expensive when I was a kid to, to go buy them, so that's why I don't have a lot of them. Alan Davis, Jack Morris, Von Hayes, Rick Horton. And let's see what we've got here. Oh, look at this. A couple of Barry Bonds. Yep. And as you can hear my dog in the background, I'm going to pause it for a second. Yeah, he gets excited whenever people uh, walk by. So I just had to ask him what his problem was. Because uh, some of you know that we have a, uh, an apartment that's attached to the side of the house, which is still a separate building, and we rent it out to tourists who come down here to visit Disney World in Orlando, Florida. So we... we the close proximity, you know, he sees them and he wants to bark and say hi. And little tiny toy schnauzer. And again, back to this card. It's a nice card. Again, when he was really lean, you know, real fit. Five-time gold glove. So that's a nice card to have uh, for the Barry Bonds fans out there. Um, a slight ding right here, but outside of that, it's in pretty nice shape. Um, I'm going to sleeve that up. And then here's the Leaf 96. Barry Bonds, not too bad, looks good, pretty decent shape, we're going to sleeve that one up too, now here's a nice one, Kenta Maeda, Maeda, rookie card, Cameron Rupp, Keith Hessler, ah, Didi Gregorius, that's kind of nice, I know that's not his rookie card, but I, I saw this card, somebody pulled this the other day, and and it's it's real nice. Uh, I thought it was a real nice look on how much effort that he puts into throwing that ball. That's real nice. Let's see, Jose Iglesias. Oh, look at this! Another 1978 tops. It's a little off center on the back, but. Based on the condition of my 78, some of my 78s, because I actually had them since I was a kid. Uh, again, this is a nice card. I'm going to put this in my PC. It's got, this, like I said, slight ding right here. But definitely, it more than likely is in a lot better shape than mine in my set. You figure as a teenager, yeah, those cards, you know. As a young teen, I was about, I think, 12 when I started. No, not, not 12. I was... Uh, 11 when I started getting cards back in 79 and 80. So Frank White, Mark Grant, Chris Spear, Louis Meadows, Alfredo Griffin, Cal Daniels, 
Mike Sosha, Walt Terrell, Louis Aguayo, Steve Farr. Oh, here's another Dale Murphy. Charlie Puleo. David Gallagher. Oh, look at this. There's another Wade Boggs. We've had a few Wade Boggs. It's been pretty nice. There's Billy Swift, Hal Morris, Brian Dubois. I'm not even, even trying, Jim. And then Mike McFarlane. It's a nice card from Fleer Ultra. I didn't set all the cards aside, so, you know, but I, the only one that's for me would be the 78 top. So here's Jesse Orozco, Larry Parrish, Eric Anthony. Here's a Charlie Moore, pretty, basically the same condition as mine. Uh, here's a Larry McWilliams. These are the uh, 1981 tops. I've got plenty of those. If, anybody's in, if anybody needs some of the 81 tops, let me know. Um, throw a number, uh, uh, like the card numbers you're looking for. Uh, I'll see if I have what I have for my doubles. And if I have it in the doubles, uh, we'll work something out. Uh, Daryl Evans, Mike Heaton, Jamie Navarro, Scott Erickson, Bob Patterson. Oh, here's a nice little turn the clock back. 25 years ago, look at that. It's Tommy Davis, um, but he was another one of those, or Maury Wills, sorry. Maury Wills, uh, he was another a decent player. You know, that you know he's, you know, if you can try to find some of his cards, they're a nice addition to your collection. Uh, Bill Schroeder, Willie McGee, he was another one that played for a lot of years, and he was also successful. Um, so, you know, a lot of respect to him also. Glenn Hubbard, Chris James. John Farrell, Joe Cronin, Boston. So this is, let's see, it's a 2018 Panini Diamond Kings baseball. So this is what we would call a throwback uh, to somebody. He was born October 12th, 1906. Five foot 11, weighed 180 pounds. Says, let's see, Cronin literally did all it all in baseball, serving as a player, manager, general manager, league executive, and on the Hall of Fame's board of directors during his career. Some of his best days came in Boston, where he earned five all-star berths at shortstop and won more than 1,000 games as the team's skipper. That's a nice card. I'm actually going to keep this card for my personal collection because I know I don't have that. That's a really nice card. Let's see here. Pedro Villa, Gary Varsho, Mark Gardner. You know, I like the cards, but the gold sometimes is, it kind of throws you off. Let's see, here's a first Bowman for Mackenzie Mills. Julio Franco. And a nice little Bowman's Brome, uh, Brome, Bowman's Chrome, uh, Danny Watts from the Diamondbacks. Awesome. Awesome. Again, I want to thank you guys. Oh, wait, wait. I can't thank you until I do the right thing here, right? Uh oh, that 99. Let's see if we can't find any rookies in here. Let's see if we can't find something nice. Let's hope this pack is just as broken apart as the other pack was. Oh yes, and let's see what happened here. Is it going to stick? Looks like it's going to stick too. Yep, there's the line. Oh man, that's okay. This one is going to be the Dodgers. So we've got Miguel Garcia, Walt Weiss, Tony Armas, Jose Vizcano, Cano, Mike Davis, Gary Redis. That's kind of nice. See, he's real excited to be in the Pirates uniform. He's like, I'm, this is where I'm home. Lenny Harris, Darren Dalton. And there's Jimmy Navarro again, and this is, again, he's got that line on the back of the card. Here is John Crook. Uh, he was another decent player, a good utility player, I feel. Rick Sutcliffe, he was a, a really nice pitcher, very successful. Jeff Reed. Mike Dyer. Here we go, Jim Rice. That's a nice little Jim Rice towards the end of his career, and he was another extremely good player. 
Um, a lot of respect uh, to him also. And then Rick Aguilera. So these are the cards again. As you can see, I have a couple more boxes to open. Um, the cards, again, that I set aside. Um, here's the Barry Bonds. The five-time gold glove. The Leaf Studio from 96. So these are some nice cards. Um, they are available because I know there's a few of you Bonds fans out there. If you don't have these, let me know. We'll take care of you. And then these two I'm keeping from my personal collection. Steve Foucault. Again, this is a, just a nice uh, replacement card. I actually don't believe I have him. I don't remember seeing that name in there. So if, if not, then boy, that to me, this this pack, and they're only $4.99 in my, in my uh, Walgreens. You know, so it was definitely worth it just uh, for this card and then to, to get this card that, I, that I've, I don't have. So uh, thank you guys again for watching. Uh, shout out to the card crew and their 15 channel giveaway. You guys have a chance. Go to Wicked Discounts and, and take a look at that video where all the details are. In the meantime, you guys enjoy. Stay safe and have fun collecting. Bye.